Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Project Gotham Racing 4. Today is episode number 10, and we are carrying on where we left off in the last episode. So I've gotten a uh, couple of comments from some past videos um, saying that bikes are better for drifting uh, from Nick Jeffries. So thank you for that. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to... Well, we're going to drive a bike because we've got a, a Time versus Kudos event first. So we're going to try see if we can do any better than... Uh, basically do better than we did before. Because before we were doing absolutely dreadful. Right, let's do this then. Right, we're going. Okay, so A is handbrake. That's good. Oh, okay. It actually works. That is pretty impressive. I'm surprised that the bikes actually drift. I did not know that was a thing. And I played Project Gotham Racing for quite a while now as a kid. That is amazing. It's surprising what you actually learn when you're doing this kind of thing. Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> kind of fell off, maybe. Okay, yeah, so it's a little bit of getting used to at the moment. Fifth place so far. Urgh. There we go, drifting all over there. If we get better than last place, I'll be happy. Sixth place now. Not good. There we go. That was a very good drift there. Oh no, we fell off. I was showing off a little bit too much. Yeah, wheelies don't work. Right, we can do wheelies on the final straight. I don't think that was very good. Fourth place. Okay. So, for the first time actually doing that, giving that a try, um, I think, yes, there was... There was a better... It was better than before. Um, bikes are obviously the way to go. That's for sure. Hopefully, we can do a little bit better on the next time. It's just a little bit of a learning curve. The fact is, I'm not very good with bikes in games, because a lot of games don't actually have bikes in them anymore. Um, I know Isle of Man TT is quite a difficult game for me. Um, what else is quite difficult? You've got um, Ride as well, which is a bike racing game. That's a little bit difficult. Uh, so this is a timed run, actually. Nice drift there. Ooh. 
Perfect. That was a good one there. Good corner. Nicely done. Vodafone. Free advertising. Oh, I tried drifting there and it didn't go very well. It's not very easy, that's for sure. It's a little bit more difficult than other games. There we go, that was a good drift. Just a little slide, that's all we need. Where's this finish line? Here we go, it's all the way down here. We definitely need to pick up some speed. Let's try and just not crash this time. Because if we crash into the wall, we're going to lose a lot more time. a little bit. There we go, a little bit of a drift. Stay at a controllable speed through that chicane. There we go. Eight kudos. There we go. Nicely done. Just a little bit of kudos each time, but that's better than nothing. And a great corner as well. not get first but we might get second or third the bike is not very quick at all Nine seconds slower, that's not going to be good. Fourth, maybe. Fourth. Urgh. Oh, that was not good. That was not a good race. Right, let's continue on to the next one. Uh, we got ourselves 10,000 kudos, though. I don't think we're getting out of this with a win. We could potentially aim for a second place overall. But the only way we can get a second place is by winning the next two. Uh, this is a cone sprint, so this should be okay. Right, let's go. The 
The weird thing about this game, though, is it mixes bikes and cars, which no other game really does, except Motorstorm. And Motorstorm is, well, it's a stunning game, and I want to play it on the channel, but I need a PS3 for that. Um, oh, I want to play Motorstorm. Oh, now that I've mentioned it, oh, God. We're going to have to buy a PS3 now. Um, but, yeah, the, the fact is... Ooh, not very good. Where has the grip gone? There was no control. It was all wobbly. Um, but yeah, bikes don't normally mix in games. They normally have like cars, bikes, and their own thing as their own separate things. Come on, come on. Don't get any more penalties. Woo, that was a lot of penalties. We are not doing very well. I'm not very good with bikes. And there's that loss of grip again on that corner. I really am not very good with bikes. Fourth, 2.20. The wind time was 2.18. Wow. Fourth place again. That's ridiculous. So we're fourth overall still yet again. Championship leaderboard. Yeah. Final stage. Right. Time versus kudos. We're probably not going to do very well on this, but it's worth a shot. I definitely prefer cars to bikes in this game. But bikes are alright. There's no problem with bikes. Wheelie kudos there. Drift kudos, nice. Oh, that was nice. The bike didn't like the exit though. Amazing. I think we're getting the hang of this actually. Yeah, look at that. That time is amazing. Right, let's do wheelies. some drift there. It wasn't great, but it was a drift. There we go, some extra kudos there.
Right, quick. There we go. That was a good corner there. Right, we'll see how well we're doing at the next checkpoint. Oh. We are first, just about. Thirty-one, yes, first place. I don't like how he took that corner though with his hands in the air. That was a little bit creepy. So I think overall we're probably going to end up with a third place position. Um, fingers crossed. Yes, third place position. I am happy with that because that is a that's a podium finish. And a podium finish is always good no matter what. Uh, finish the championship. So we are 30th overall. We have quite a lot of points still left to go. Before we get up to 974 for the master. Uh, so we have a qualifier onto a seasonal. Oh no, major. They're called majors. So we're going to take ourselves a D-Class car. And I want to... I don't know why, but I want to drive the Lamborghini in the Invitational. So I'm going to drive this, the Mitsubishi. We're going to see how well we do on that. And then if it is D-Class, then we'll give the Lamborghini Diablo a drive. Listen to that turbo, though. Mitsubishi is honestly an amazing car. Let's do this. Right, slowing for the corners. It's been a while since I've played this game, so I'm going to have to get used to, like, breaking times and stuff like that. Because there is no driving line in this game. Not that I need a driving line. Not at all. But it's just the fact that a driving line sort of helps with the adjustment process. Um, but I know all the lines anyways. I've played enough racing games to know. Oh, we've hit a wall, we've hit two walls, we've hit three. That is fairly quick, that Mitsubishi. That has got some speed. 59 seconds we have qualified for the Major. Now we could take the Mitsubishi again because of how well that actually performed. But I want to give the Lamborghini a go. I really want to drive that Lamborghini. Right, so let's go to the... It's a D-Class. Hmm... Oh, wait, we are D-Class. Never mind, I thought we were C. Um, so, yeah, let's give the Diablo a go. And I want our design on there. Here we go. Street race, first of all. If we come first, we get ourselves a huge point bonus. Okay, so we got Group A, Group B, Group C, Group D... The guy who's first in the tournament is actually playing with us at the moment. Oh my gosh, look at this car. How do we change camera angle? Oh my gosh, the interior looks stunning. Now 
No, stay away. We're still having those weird audio glitches with cars though. Certain cars. It's very unusual. Slow down for the corner. Probably slow down a little bit too early. That was an amazing corner there. We went really wide for some reason. I'm guessing we had way too much speed into that corner. Here we go, slowing down. Going to the inside. Look how nice this car looks though. It's a Lamborghini Diablo. So it's a two lap event as well that we're doing. There we go. Ooh, power slide. Nice. Great corners going on there. I can't get this car to drift, which is weird. To be fair though, you can see it's got some chunky rear tires, so that's probably why it won't drift. It has some very chunky rears. We weren't supposed to break for that corner. What is he doing? There we go. Drop my phone. Here we go. Slow down for this corner. Perfect. Right, let's see how far on the inside we can take this corner this time. That was much better. No, that's gone wide. Back to the hairpins. Ooh, crash into the wall there. Not very good. And here we go. Final corner. Slow it down. Bring it in. Oh, we've hit the wall. That's not good. I wanted to make that final bit. Oh, that number plate's glitching through the car. That is weird.
Right, so we move on along with the person who's in first place. So, uh, kind of annoying. Because uh, we don't want the person in first place to be getting any points. Street race, America's knockout major. Right, let's do this. So we have to come first place. go Bridgestone We've overshot it. Oh, we took the bike out. I feel really bad. Here we go. Oh, hit the wall. Not very good. Right, hopefully we can catch up with this guy, because he's got a way too powerful vehicle. Right, we are catching up slowly. At least we didn't mess that corner up again. We're definitely slowly but surely catching up. Come on, we can do this. Come on, come on. I have total concentration now. Drafting, drafting, drafting. Come on, overtake. Yes, first place. What are you doing? Stay back. I'm trying to sabotage my race here. Oh, I do not want to be sliding. Cars catching up. It's got more acceleration. We've come first though, which I'm hoping that means first place has just been knocked out. So he doesn't move forward. If I see him in the final event, oh, I'm gonna be pissed with the game. Target one on one. Go head to head against a single opponent. That seems pretty good actually. And it's not the guy who was in first. But he is in an Aston Martin. We should easily beat that. Great corner. 
corner, yes. Nicely done. Slow down for this corner here. Yes, perfect. La Lamborghini, La Lamborghini. A little bit of KSI there. There we go. kudos, which isn't a lot actually, although Aston's catching up. Oh, my phone went off and I looked down. No. Why? Why did I look down? We have an entire second to catch up with now. But it doesn't look too bad. It looks like we are actually catching up. Our car was definitely going way too fast. I was braking at the same time as him as well. Right, no more messing up. And as he says that, he messes up that corner. Ah! Pay attention to the corners. That might be the reason why, is because of the camera angle. That's much better. That feels so much smoother going on a closer camera angle. Yeah, I think that's it. Game over. Unless I can catch up now, but he's too far away. He's too far away. Ah, oh, second. We didn't win. Oh, we've done that twice now. Twice in a row, two finals, where we've just messed up. Ah, oh, total failure. We are 28th, though. We got loads of points for that. And we got 136,000 kudos, which we could use to buy some more. I mean, Ferraris is a good one. We got some good Ferraris there, actually. I might get that. 
Let's get the Ferrari pack. So, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. And if you want to help support the channel, hit that join button, it means the world to me, and I will see you in the next one in Europe. Goodbye. Love and love.